Okay, Oya fans. Um, um, I received uh, my Oya. I bought it uh, from a Kickstarter backer who didn't uh, want his... Um, who wasn't interested. Anyway, um, I had some issues with the controller. Um, and as you can see, I've taken the back off. And one of the first problems with it was originally the... Um, the analog flipper was getting hung underneath the digital buttons but um, there's a tab that goes under here normally you wouldn't be able to see the crack between the buttons because there's a wall of plastic that's attached to the top uh, digital button and I had to shave that off uh, with the Dremel drill and also the uh, the analog the analog uh, flippers were scraping against the edge of the uh, plastic controller case, and so as you can see, I had to shave a little bit off of this area right here and right here. And last uh, but not well, and another thing uh, with the uh, flippers. You notice um, now that I've modded the controller, the uh, the mechanism. Hold on, let me. The mechanism is butter smooth. If I get the camera to focus. The mechanism is butter smooth now. It used to make a horrible squeaky noise. Um, I fixed the squeaking problems with uh, using uh, DuPont uh, silicone Teflon lubricant, which you can buy at Lowe's, um, and it is plastic safe. Never use uh, WD-40 on injection molded plastic parts. It will uh, deteriorate the uh, finish. But um, as you can see, there's no more squeaks. And finally, the... Um, the I, I didn't have initially have problems with the buttons sticking, but after f a few hours of gameplay, I noticed that uh, they did stick. And the solution is to widen the holes. Um, there are some slight burrs on the button holes, but um, you won't you won't be able to feel the burrs because the buttons stick up above the burrs. And as you can see, the buttons uh, now wiggle have a little bit of wiggle room and they will not uh, stick. And there's one other problem that I encountered and that I don't think it can be fixed uh, by uh, modding the hardware but if you press down on an analog trigger and then you touch one of the uh, face buttons or the D-pad while the um, while the trigger is depressed, the um, the and then you let go of the button in the game, the the game will act as though the trigger has been released, even though you're still holding down on it. And I've found that that can cause uh, problems with pinball arcade. Okay, here you can see the uh, crack between the buttons. From where I filed down uh, the original um, the the original plastic tabs, and I'm also going to be uploading a Flickr stream onto my uh, a picture photo stream onto my Flickr account that demonstrates exactly where uh, to cut the, uh, the the to grind away the plastic so that the um, the analog triggers don't get hung underneath the digital buttons. Um, anyway, uh, my Oya controller works absolutely great now. Um, with some simple modifications, uh, yours uh, will too. Uh, thanks for watching.